My name's Gwen, I'm 19 years old. My mum passed away in 2012 when I was 14 in an accident at home. She was sent to intensive care unit where she was for two days and that's when we were asked whether we would like to donate her organs. Luckily, a few weeks prior to her death, I had a homework to do a speech in my English class and I asked my mum to help me, what should I do my English speech on? And when I asked her, she was watching a programme on organ donation and she decided we should do it on that and that's when we had the conversation and otherwise I don't think the conversation would have come up. My mum was a primary school teacher and she was 43 when she passed away and her kidney was donated to a lady who was also a primary school teacher at a similar age. After receiving a kidney, she was telling, she wrote us a letter. Dear family, my life and health is now improving every day. The gift of a functioning kidney means that I will now be able to do things which have been difficult in recent years, such as enjoy a family holiday without the constraints of dialysis, go swimming in the sea, take a long soak in a bath, ride horses again, but most importantly, live life to the full and enjoy each day. But please know, not a day passes when I don't think of her and thank her for this gift she has given to me and my family. On the 17th of April each year, when I celebrate the day when my life started again, I will say a prayer and remember her. We've created a charity called Cronva LN, which is this, what this badge is. And what we try to do is promote the discussion of organ donation. It's a difficult topic to discuss, but it's beneficial for you as a family if anything ever happened. There's so many people waiting and just a quick conversation could save a lot of other people's lives. So the thing you should do is discuss with your family. It's just a simple yes or no to tell them what your wishes would be if anything ever happened. Because it made our time in hospital a lot easier.